also Joe Biden said something that's very, that should really concern everybody. It should really concern it. The silence on this question is deafening in the Joe Biden campaign. Uh, Kamala Harris refused to answer this question on Wednesday. Joe Biden refused to answer it in the first debate. And uh, what's it? Uh, Vice President Pence, he really put it the best. He said that the Democrats are, are mad that they didn't get their way, that things didn't go their way. They're mad that they don't have the executive branch. They're mad that they don't have the Senate. They're mad that they don't have the authority. They're mad that they're probably really ticked off at Ruth Bader Ginsburg for dying when she did. They're so mad at, at not having power that they're threatening to change the entire American judicial system as a result. And Joe Biden refuses to come out and answer whether or not he agrees with a lot of his counterparts in the Democratic Party about stacking the court. And he was asked about it again. And instead of answering the question, he said something which I think is probably one of the worst and scariest responses a politician has ever given to any question. Listen to what he said. You'll know my opinion of court packing when the election is over. Now, look, I know it's a great question, y'all, and I don't blame you for asking but you know, the moment I answer that question, the headline in every one of your papers will be about that. You will know the answer after the election, meaning vote for me if you want to find out where I stand on the issues. This is very similar to the Obamacare uh, resolution that Nancy Pelosi said, you, you can read it after we pass it. It's so bad. It's so terrifying. It's so un-American that we don't want you to see it. But if you vote for us, then we'll show it to you. And then you can go, oh my God, that's horrible. I probably shouldn't have voted for that person. Not only that, he then goes on to, and he should have just shut up. This is what prob This is one of the biggest problems Joe Biden has when he goes out for public appearances without his teleprompter. He should have shut up after that because that statement is bad enough. They'll know my opinion of court packing when the election is over. Now look, now look, now, now look, that was a horrible answer. And I probably shouldn't have said that, but I'm going to go on and continue speaking. What he said afterward was, if I tell you my answer, it's going to be the headline on every newspaper around the the country. He knows that if he says, yes, we need to pack the court, everybody in the country is going to know that's his stance. Why? He said, you're going to put it on the front page of every newspaper or blog, I think is probably what he meant because nobody reads. There's no, there's no newspapers anymore. And he knows that if that's on the headline of every newspaper, he will be gu guaranteed lose this election. Court packing is, is not, this is not uh, of a throwaway subject. This is important. You want to talk about a political party so mad and so belligerent that they are not in power that should they get power, they're going to alter the Supreme Court of the United States to suit their needs, not the needs of Americans, not the needs of the of the people who elected President Trump and the Republican Senate, the needs of themselves, their party, and and the people that they are that are in power at the time. They're going to alter a system that's been working trucking along fine for 150 years just because. They they're mad. This is not a group of people you want to have in power. And they know it and they're hiding it. Joe Biden himself said, he said, if you, if I tell you the answer to this question, it's going to be the big story. It's going to be all anyone's going to want to talk about. And if you were running for president and if you were secure in your agenda and if you thought that your moral compass was pointing in the right direction and if your ideas you felt were to the benefit of all Americans, you wouldn't hide them. You would want them on the front page of every paper. But Joe Biden does not. I know it's a great question, y'all, and I don't blame you for asking but you know, the moment I answer that question, the headline in every one of your papers will be about that. And my campaign will be over, not to mention my entire political career.